Brian Powell of I Run Far here with Ellie Greenwood of, uh, of Scotland, but lives in Canada. How are yeah. you today, Ellie? Good, thank you, yeah. Um, congratulations on your recent uh, World 100K Championships. How does it feel? That was great, yeah. Yeah, it's really, uh, I was just saying, my first 100K on road, so definitely going into an unknown. Very tough race for me, uh, so in a sense, all the more satisfying to come out and win at the end. So. Yeah, you, Lizzie uh, Hawker, and Monica Carlin had I was just following it online, every lap, and yeah. the, the exchanges you guys had were amazing. Can you fill us in a little bit on that last, maybe, quarter of the race? Yeah, I mean, I definitely went through a you know, dip in the middle, and I was like, I'm just going to try and make it to the finish line, forget anything about positioning. I could see Lizzie was still doing really well. Um, Monica, I mean, I have to say, I didn't know a lot of the European racers, so I kind of knew an Italian was out there. <laughs> and uh, yeah, but the last, yeah, it was about the last 25K, I started to get a second win, feel good. And yeah, from what, even the reactions of people I saw, I was like, I think I'm gaining on them. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, so- So you were in was, third with 25K to go? Or? I was in third with 7K to go. Uh, yeah, it was the penultimate lap and I saw Monica and I thought, okay, I can catch her and in the same, literally there, I also saw Lizzie ahead, so within the space of a minute, I overtook them both, went into first, and then I thought, if I'm in first at this place, I'm not going to let it go now, right? I've just got to go for it. So a 7k to go, you passed them both and then built a 7 minute lead, no, uh, you're only three, three or four minutes ahead. I was about uh, a minute and a half ahead of Monica at the end. Okay, and yeah. Lizzie was a couple And Lizzie back. was a couple more minutes yeah. back. But there's yeah. probably a big gap yeah. to fourth, so. I, yeah, I, I think so. Yeah, it was definitely the three of us at the front and which order we're going in. You guys were but switching it up during the race as we, well. Yeah, 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 like, yeah. So what was the hardest part of that race for you? Um, I think the hardest part was definitely sort of halfway through or so, like I have uh, troublesome hamstrings and obviously running on the tarmac when I'm a bit more used to trail, um, that was really tough and just mentally I think, you know, going into loads of doing a looped course is quite... It was a, 19 It laps. was 19 laps, yeah. So, uh, but I knew on the British team we had three women and you have to have three to count mm -hmm. towards a team award, so basically I was like... Even if I crawl in at a time I'm disappointed with, maybe we can still get a decent placing mm -hmm. as a team. And, and then it shows it pays off. You can go through rough spots and uh, be lucky and pull out at the end. Lucky so, yeah. and take home four gold medals. Well, yeah, yeah, <laughs> which is not bad. It's not yeah. bad. Yeah, for sure. Um, so you were in the, you know, the flat 100K World Championships. The race, big race before you before that was the Canadian Death Race, yeah. which is a big mountainous loop. Uh, 70 miles or so, 70, 75 miles? It's so. 125k, yeah, yeah so yeah, right about so. that, yeah. Um, and you you shattered the women's course record and were second to Hal Corner there, yeah, so yeah, tell yeah, us that, a little bit about the yourself on the trails and the mountains. Um, I mean, for both of those races, I did, which I've done more this year, specifically go, okay, I'm focusing on this race, get that race done, and now move on to the other one. Mm -hmm. So yeah, death race, I was doing tons of power hiking, ups, downs, long climbs, and that kind of stuff. And living in Banff, I mean, I had great training grounds for it. Um, so that was good. And um, well, I, I do remember at one point where someone said, Ellie, you're in second place to Hal Kerner, and that just made me laugh so much. <laughs> I was like, no, 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 there's got to be other people out there. So that was kind of, you know, funny. And it's, there was definitely good runners out there, but some of the guys went out there and, you know, Obviously, as you do in some races, you go, okay, I'll push it, and it doesn't always work, and they dropped. Mm -hmm. And uh, it was funny, I was talking to one of the other women at the start, and we were saying, how, well, we'll just hold back, we'll be sensible, we'll pick the guys off later on. And, <laughs> and you did. Uh, as it turned out, we did, right? So, uh, yeah. Um, so you ran the flat roads in the mountainous Canadian death race. You sort of have a middle ground here in the Marin Headlands at the North yeah, Face Championships. So but, how, what do you think about that? Um, I'll go and see. I've not run here before, which I know a lot of the other racers have. So yes, I am at a disadvantage in that sense. But uh, yeah, I mean, my attitude is you go out, you do your best on the day, you enjoy it, hopefully you do well. And uh, if I don't, I'm running on new trails and that's yeah. fun. So yeah. So what do you think about the, the competition? Because you actually race some great women at the World 100Ks, but there's even more. There's even more, yeah, no, this is a way more competitive race. Um, my attitude is you run the best race you can, and if that brings you in first, that's absolutely amazing. You can still have an amazing race and maybe come in, you know, fourth, fifth, whatever, I don't know. But, uh, and yes, it's nice to win, but I think as any runner, you do it for personal satisfaction, and if you get a time that you're happy with and have a good race, 
to be honest, that's, that's all you can ask for. You can't control who else is out there. Mm -hmm. Well, I may you find some personal satisfaction out <laughs> okay. this weekend and enjoy the new trails. Okay, thanks. Take care. All right.